Good afternoon. It has been some time since I've been back onto uh, YouTube. Uh, the reason being is I was walking up the steps and decided to do a backward flip with no water. I broke my back in two places. So I got carbon rods and plates in my back. I'll try to explain that to you. And it's taken me this long just to get back to do some filming. Now, the uniforms behind me. Now, this uniform is a colour sergeant, a, a drum major. And that is to show his rank. Could be a colour sergeant. Technically, could be a private soldier because a drum major and drummers is not a rank. It's a name that the command officer gives when you go in there. Now, this particular one I got there is from the drum major of the 24th. So the drum major of the 1st and 2nd Battalion at Islandowana would have been wearing this type of uniform. And the drum major of the 2nd Battalion was left there and his name was Foot with an E. And I just happened to know the person that owns his South African medal for the battle at Rockstrift and his Ndwana. So it, there's always an interesting story behind them. Now this one here, again interesting story, that's the type of uniform that the 24th which is the Warwickshire's at that time would have been wearing. And this one has got a Victoria Cross on. And it's on there just to show. Uh, by the way, don't bother knocking my door, it's not a real one. Now, you can just imagine being on a veldt, which is a flat area, green, green background, and you stand in there like um, a stick. Well, it rhymes with stick. With, your, with red uniforms on, you're seen for miles away. And that was the disadvantage. A Zulu could be a couple of feet from you and not seen. But then we got other uniforms. Now we got one for the Welsh Regiment. I couldn't get the tidy assistant, he wouldn't put the skirt on. Now this one is the 1st Battalion, the Welsh Regiment, and this is Lieutenant Colonel Powell. Uh, not a bad state. You see, didn't do much. Well, none of them done, but never mind. And the other Welsh one we got is quite close to to my art is when I joined in 66 there was a new adjutant that come to the depot in Cordrochlan 
and this adjutant was Captain Grandi, brilliant officer, looked after his men, liked to show appreciation and he ended up as my commanding officer. And when I finished my time, I came out of the army, I went to RHQ in Cardiff and he was the regimental secretary. And this is his uniform. I look inside because inside the pocket is usually the name of the, the person. We call them Francis, it's the nearest we can get to. Now, interesting thing about this one is the regiment went for about 36 years, from 1969 to March the 1st, 2006. The Welsh regiment and the borders were disbanded. Interesting thing, right up until the end, we still got the Welsh Regiment collar dogs. I couldn't go down with the Welsh Regiment collar dogs. I'd be sacrificed. But Colonel Grundy, a very nice man. I got a quiz for you. Now, as you can see down by there, you can't, can, I'll pick it up, don't worry. Now if there's a fire, when I first joined the regiment, you'd have a fire picket. And the fire picket would run out, these, stir a pump, and pump like hell. Now I'm having, I'm having difficulty at this moment in time because I keep using the, uh, the bucket but I can't get it to work and I put the finer sand in there and I pump but nothing comes out here. Now can you tell me what I'm doing wrong? because I haven't got a clue. I didn't put many fires out either. This is just, just a thought. What we will be doing is we'll be doing just short, light um, pieces uh, until I'm fit enough to walk round. What we'll do, we'll try to keep them light hearted. So, look after yourself. And remember, the only trip you should do is the one to the seaside, not on the steps. Keep well, keep safe, all the best from Richie, Bill and Francis. He said he'd put a skirt on next time for us, or a dress. His wife will shave his legs. So, look after yourself, keep safe. And may you God go with you, whoever he is. Good afternoon. We're here today to talk about some uniforms. On my right side, there's the uniform of the drum major, and the drum major in the second battalion was drum major foot. Now, the drum major could be a private, could be anything. This one here is one of the VC winners, but it's the type, that type of uniform he'd be wearing. 
we'll go on then to some from the Welsh Regiment. And we've got a couple here, but only go on, one. Battery's going. Come, move. Battery's I'll, going. That there. Hiya. Hiya. That. Hiya. You got the job. Um, that there. 30 seconds. Come on. Come on, Alan. Move. That there is now mine, but I can't get in it because I'm too fat. This one here is also mine, and I can't get in that because I'm also fat. And Francis is working 